Hello friends and welcome to another video. Today we're going to be trying out Harry Potter sorting hat bath bombs. And I'm jazzed. I'm jazzed too. We're jazzed. So I saw these bath bombs both on Instagram and in a bunch of articles written about them. Basically the way they work is that they you can't tell what's inside from the outside and then you dump them in the bath and then they turn a house color and they sort you. I have taken the Pottermore sorting hat quiz probably like five times. The Wait, quiz, why? Just because it's fun. I think it's because you get sorted into the wrong house and then you have to take it again. So you might identify as a Ravenclaw, but really you're only a Ravenclaw like two out of five times. That's not true. Three out of five times. I've taken it about five times. Fake Ravenclaw. I've gotten Ravenclaw four times and Slytherin once. Oh, that's pretty good. The reason Tyler hasn't taken the Pottermore quiz is because he took the Patronus quiz and he didn't like his results. I got a pheasant. I, you know, I, I got a blackbird, which I'm fine with. Like what's the pheasant gonna do? It's just gonna be like, <laughs> you, the Vandor. I think Tyler's a Gryffindor. I'm a Thunderbird. I think Tyler, well, that's a diff different question. We're American, so we actually went to Ilver Morney, but just scrap that for now. So Tyler's gonna take a bath, try out that bath bomb, and then we're gonna take the Pottermore quiz to see if the bath bomb was right. Then I'm gonna take the Pottermore quiz once again to show you guys that I'm truly a Ravenclaw, and then I'll get a bath bomb as well. Let's do this. This is my first bath in like a really, really long time. We're shower people. We've been dating for two years. I don't think you've ever taken a bath. I've taken like two, one bath in that time. You're not a big bath fan. I just, I like the shower on, I like things getting washed down. I pee in the shower. You can't pee in the bath. You can't pee in the bath. Mm -hmm. Is my chest hair on full blast right now? By the way, I'm seeing a lot of kitty litter in this bath with me, so. I tried to clean it out. Oh, it's on my foot though. There's just a layer of kitty litter everywhere in our apartment. I'd be fine with any of the houses. I kind of self-identify as a Gryffindor. Hufflepuff has been growing on me lately. So much power in such a small thing. Oh my god. What? This is the second bath bomb that just completely disintegrated my hands. Wait, what the hell? So I ordered a six pack of these Harry Potter sorting hat bath bombs and I tried to open one and it disintegrated in my hands as I was opening it and it was a Ravenclaw. And I, then I tried to open a second one and it fell into the sink and disintegrated in my hands and it was also a Ravenclaw. So I'm pretty sure there must be no Ravenclaws left. Because some of them disintegrated, I mean, they're coming from England, right? I don't know where they're coming from. Well, they've come a long distance to be at this point. So I'm just gonna open this guy over the bath so we can at least figure out what it is. Oh, this thing smells incredible, dude. Is it, is it edible? I don't know, try it. Oh! Oh! Bombed! I, I guess I'm a Slytherin. The Dark Lord has chosen me. It smells really good over it here. It smells amazing. It smells like Slytherin, man. It feels great. It feels like there's a thin layer of candy in my body. This is interesting, because I've never thought of myself as a Slytherin, but I do like Slughorn. I said that I was open to any of the houses, and I'm gonna stick by it. You have to embrace what you get. My dad always said to me, you just gotta, you gotta be Joe whatever you're doing. So I'm Joe Slytherin right now. Only I can live forever. I can't really see this whole dark work right there. Literally, how deep is this water? <laughs> it's like two inches deep. You feel soft and you smell pretty nice. Softer than usual. You know what, I'm committing to Slytherin right now. Yeah, I hope you... I get Slytherin here. So maybe it was fate that I ruined the first two bath bombs. Yeah. The first two- Would you have liked if I was in Ravenclaw? I would have liked it. Yeah? I mean- You need a Ravenclaw obsession. All right, be sure to discover your house. Moon or stars? Now, I like stars, but I do love a big, pale moon. Take a butt. Oh, here we go. If you were attending Hogwarts, which pet would you choose to take with you? Tabby cat? Siamese cat? White cat? You know, actually, I don't need to do this. I know it would be a tabby cat. Right? Yeah. I think Krusty would love Hogwarts. Krusty is definitely a Slytherin. Okay, after you have died, what would you most like people to do when they hear your name? Miss you, but smile. Ask for more stories about your adventures. I don't care what people think of me after I'm dead. It's what they think of me while I'm alive that counts. Well, clearly one of those is <laughs> Slytherin. It's funny when they try to plant the questions and they're painfully obvious. Yeah. They're like, are you cool with horcruxes? Heads or tails? Mm. This is a big one. Oh God, this is hard. I'm going tails. There you go. <gasps> What? I thought you were going for Slytherin. I'm all twisted up now, guys. Because like I went into this saying like, you know, I've self-identified as a Gryffindor. I didn't get it from the, the bath bomb. I, I, I find that the bath bomb is the more official test. And so I was like, okay, I'm team Slytherin. I'm very conflicted. Okay, so let's let's do mine. Are you gonna have to return your uh, robe if you're not Ravenclaw? Dawn or dusk? Dusk. How would you like to be known to history? The wise, the good, the great, the bold. 
They're I mean, literally in the colors. See, this is when you're like, soft. you're just choosing what will help you get into Ravenclaw. Authentic test taking over here. Which of the following would you most like to Still study? Wagging. Centaurs, goblins, merpeople, trolls. Troll in the dungeon! Watch what to know. Left or right? I'm on your left, so. I think it's gotta be left. I think left is interesting. Ravenclaw! <laughs> <laughs> freaked him out so much. I'm trying to, he just wants to hang out. We just freaked Krusty out so bad. Okay, so I got Ravenclaw. Do you find that on your sixth time taking the test, it's easier to get Ravenclaw again? I mean. We'll let the we'll let the bath bomb decide. Oh my god, my lint for my feet just got everywhere. Just don't zoom in on the lint. I swear I cleaned this tub. You wanna sip of the Kubi Sun? I'm not nervous. Yeah, I wanna sip the Kubi Sun. I mean, I ruined two Ravenclaw ones. So maybe I was meant to be in Ravenclaw, they just broke. Or maybe Tyler was meant to be in Ravenclaw. Or maybe Tyler was meant to be in Slytherin and I was supposed to break both. The only reason I don't want Hufflepuff is because it's just gonna look like I peed. This is Destiny right here. Ready? Ooh. What is uh, it? What is it? I can't tell. Wait, what is it? What color is it? I don't know, man. What color is it? Oh, there you go. It's yellow. <laughs> Stop peeing, man. You knew you were a squib, so you just decided oh, to pee. Oh. No. Listen, Hufflepuff has the best location for their house. Hufflepuff is like next to the kitchen. It smells great. It feels nice. Let me see. But it's a nice bath bomb, right? Yeah, it smells nice. It smells just kind of like generically sweet, like kind of vanilla-ish. And then in general, like I feel like the nice coating, there's some like lotions or moisturizers in there. The interesting thing is like, I've never gotten Hufflepuff on any quizzes. So like maybe, there is a part of me that's Hufflepuff. The the part that likes to take baths and I don't nourish it enough. Maybe Hufflepuff is like, yo, take some more baths, dude. So we wanted to do an extra bath bomb for Krusty and we're not gonna be able to get Krusty in here. Um, not I don't able to, we're not putting Krusty in, are you crazy? Oh shit. Oh! <laughs> Did that just fall apart? That's what happened to you. So it sorted Krusty correctly. What Krusty. that means is that clearly this thing is correct. Tyler and Krusty, match made in heaven, were both Slytherins. That's photo evidence, guys. Here is one of the ones that Sophia dropped as she was cutting it open. You wanna go third bath on there? I mean, we already ruined it. Oh, just kidding, I'm a Ravenclaw, oh! Actually, it turned into a very nice color. Yeah, that looks good. Okay, I'm gonna enjoy my bath. Sopping Myrtle in there. In general, I feel like this was fun. There's so many essential oils on my body now, I just feel like really moisturized, so that's awesome. This could add some magic to your bath, but you know, I don't know that it was accurate. In general, I think that the only true sorting happens in Hogwarts with the sorting hat, but Pottermore is probably, you know, the second after that, and then I would trust these bath bombs. Here's my list. It goes bath bomb, bath bomb, bath bomb. Team Slytherin! Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that video. Let me know if you've tried these bath bombs or if you're gonna try these bath bombs in the comments below. If you like that video, make sure to smash that like button. And if you wanna see more videos like this, make sure to smash that subscribe button. And if you are already subscribed, make sure to smash that little bell icon in the middle to turn on post notifications so you get a notification every time I post. Here are my and Tyler's social media handles. Make sure to check out my next feed. I do a lot of daily vlogging and Q and A's on there. And make sure to check out Tyler's YouTube channel. A lot of you guys have been asking when we're gonna start posting on that again. And we're gonna start posting very soon. So make sure to be there or be not there. A big shout out to Jen for watching. You put Ravenclaw in your bio, Jen. Smart move. And uh, I will see you guys uh, next time.